here's a video of me showing you guys my um, collection of the DC Comics movies that I have. Which, I have, a, I have a pretty good amount of them to show, so let's get right on to it. I also have this movie on DVD, which I'm going to show it later whenever I get to the DVDs. October 2nd, 1989, recorded on a scotch tape. Now we're moving on to the DVDs. Speaking of Aquaman, I did see Aquaman The Lost Kingdom in theaters yesterday, and... Despite the, the first movie, which I'm showing right now, needs a rewatch, but... This the sequel I thought was 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 a pretty good film. Even though even though I will say though it it isn't it's not actually as good as the first, but the Aquaman the Lost Kingdom in my opinion wasn't all that bad. In my opinion anyway. Currently on the standard side, the other side is widescreen. And this one is also a 1997 DVD, but it's repackaged in 2007. Really need to finish the full length of this movie soon. And I also do have The Dark Knight and The Dark Knight Rises on DVD, which I'm going to show those later. And yeah, speaking of Christopher Nolan, I did see um um Oppenheimer in theaters back on July no June no, yeah July of 2023 and that movie was absolutely amazing. So glad that it won um the best motion picture drama the the Golden Globe for best motion picture drama at the Golden Globes this year. Yeah, currently on the standard set, of air sides widescreen. And the back on this DVD says it's from 2005, but the disc itself is still the original 1999 DVD. And I, and I know this movie also recently turned 30 years old last year as well. This is a Vertigo DC Comics movie. I think. One of the best of the best. If anyone has not seen this movie, go ahead and watch it. It is amazing. One of the one of the best movies to, to ever to ever be made. Seriously. This one, though, I have not seen yet. Code on this one expires on December 4th, 2014. And back on this insert is blank, so not really gonna... Not gonna bother turning over the insert to show it. Directed by Martin Campbell, who also directed GoldenEye.
Does this one have an expiration date at all? Oh yeah, somewhere over here says that the code expires on October 14th, 2013. Now, this one right here, I am keeping as a place for until I get a new copy because when I try to do the opening to this DVD, but whenever I whenever I pressed play on the DVD menu, um, the DVD menu came to a came to a pretty dead silence for a pretty long time. So, yeah, this this will be a placeholder until I get a new copy. So, yeah. That's it for the DVDs, and now we're moving on to the six Blu-rays. This movie right here I saw in theaters twice on March 2022. The first time I saw it on, on March 5th, 2022 with my mom... And and I and then I saw it twice and then I saw it, um, the second time in theaters, um, with with my dad on St. Patrick's Day of twenty twenty two and this movie is is really good, seriously. I have Wonder Woman 1984 on Blu-ray, which I'm going to show that movie later. This one was produced by Christopher Nolan. But honestly, though, I wouldn't really count it a full-on Christopher Nolan movie because, um, be, be, because he didn't really direct it. He, he only produced it. This one needs a rewatch, though. I, I, I remember this being good. I also have Shazam Fury of the Gods on Blu-ray, which I'm going to show that next. And I still have not seen both of these movies yet, which I will hopefully get around to them soon. Pro probably somewhere around 2024 this year. I remember I got this um, for my birthday back in 2023. And this is also my only um, Warner Brothers Blu-ray to have that um, uh, WB100 celebrating every story um, part on, on the on the slipcover. Not going to bother showing those um, character cards, though. I forgot the back of that insert is going, but whatever. <laughs> let me just let me just put all this back. This movie right here is also another um, Vertigo DC Comics movie, as you, as you could see right there. This is also a 2008 Blu-ray, so that means this Blu-ray is, is out of print. And, and, and also hard to find. And 
And finally, the last Blu-ray. And I also do hope to get the 2017 uh, movie soon. Since that movie needs a re... Since this and and the first... And that 2017 movie need a rewatch. But I remember both of them being very good. 